comparison of fractions, decimals, percentages. Today, let's compare fractions, decimals and percentages. So, let's start with finding the decimal and percentage equivalent of a fraction. Look, there are 10 squares. Out of these 10 squares, 5 squares are blue. We can write the fraction for blue squares as 5 upon 10. When we reduce this fraction, we get 5 upon 10 is equal to 1 upon 2. Now, let us change 1 upon 2 into percentage. Thus, 1 upon 2 is equal to 1 upon 2 into 100% is equal to 50%. Now, let us change 50% into decimal. Thus, 50% is equal to 50 upon 100, which is equal to 0 0.50, which is equal to 0 0.5. Hence, we can write 1 upon 2 as 50% as percentage and 0 0.5 as decimal. Now, we will compare the fraction, decimal or percentage to find what is greater or smaller. To compare a decimal and a percentage, we either need to convert the decimal to a percentage or the percentage to a decimal. Let's compare the decimal 3.50 and 35%. Here, let's convert the decimal to a percentage. Therefore, 3.50 is equal to 3.50 into 100% is equal to 350%. 350% is greater than 35%. Thus, 3.50 is greater than 35%. Let's compare 8% and 0.8. Here, let's convert the percentage to a decimal. Therefore, 8% is equal to 8 divided by 100 is equal to 0 0.08. 0 0.08 is less than 0 0.8. Thus, 8% is less than 0 0.8. Further, if we have a fraction and a percentage, we either convert the fraction to a percentage or vice versa. Now, let's compare 1 upon 4 and 20%. Let's convert the fraction into percent. 1 upon 4 is equal to 1 upon 4 into 100% is equal to 25%, which is greater than 20%. Thus, 1 upon 4 is greater than 20%. Finally, let's compare 4 upon 10 and 140%. Here, let's convert the percent into a fraction. 140% is equal to 140 upon 100 is equal to 14 upon 10, which is greater than 4 upon 10. Thus, 4 upon 10 is less than 140%. Kids, comparing fractions, decimals and percentages was easy. Why don't you try some now?